Warren, there's there's a lot to discuss from that game, but we got to start with you pleading with the ref that you're trying to get your hat trick there when he gave you the penalty. Like, did you actually? You think there was a hope there? Uh, <laughs> yeah, I I was I was confused to be honest because I was I was kind of thinking like read read the game. Like the only reason I was out there was uh, to get the hat trick, right? I'm not on the first <laughs> unit, um, but I I thought I got cross checked and slashed, but I. Uh, I guess Steve saw it a different way. Do you think maybe he should factor that in? I, I know you're normally not out. Yeah, there. I don't know. I kind of said that to him, and then some other probably not right things. But uh, <laughs> yeah, I was obviously. Fired. But you know what? Happy we got the win, and um, you know this group keeps battling back and um, super calm, and and uh, you know hopefully we can we can uh, continue this. The the battling back's a great thing, but obviously you don't want to continue to put yourself in that hole. I think that's eight out of twelve that you've had come from behind victories. Yeah, for sure. It's uh, it's obviously not ideal, and you know, uh, Nauber talked about it before the game, and um, you know, yeah, not ideal. But you know, this group keeps sticking with it. You know, we're doing a lot of the right things, and you know, Stu was uh, played a huge game again, and you know, that's what you need from your goaltender. How much pride do you take as a team to tie the franchise record ten consecutive games by allowing two or fewer goals? Wow, I, I, I didn't even know that. Um, you know, I think it's just a credit to everyone just buying in and you know taking a lot of pride and playing the right way and. Um, you know, this group was down uh, at, at rock bottom, so, you know, a lot to uh, climb back and, you know, try to build each day. What does it mean to have a game like that when your, your bros here? What can you tell? Older, younger brother? Like, uh, that that's my older brother by uh, two years, and, uh, you know, honestly, I probably wouldn't be here if it wasn't for him. Um, you know, constantly mini stick battles, uh, letting me play road hockey with him, and, you know, I definitely get my uh, competitive drive just from battling with him throughout the years. So, you know, he's a huge part of my life, and, you know, happy. Uh, he was here tonight to give me some luck, and uh, hopefully he can bring me some more on uh, Saturday. If only you have his size, eh? Yeah, that's what we were saying, uh, my, uh, my parents and I. Uh, you know, he's a big guy, and if anyone's looking for a right-hand D, uh, looking for a comeback, uh, you know, he's ready to try out. Well, nice to put a little bit of separation between yourself and these guys. Yeah, for sure. This is a huge uh, divisional uh, opponent. You know, we're, we're clawing, uh, clawing back, and, and so are they, so, um, you know, Good that uh, you know we got the win and we got another big matchup against Calgary. Are you sensing you guys are moving yourself up in the standings? How close are you watching? I think we're aware, but you know we know there's a lot of work uh, left to do, and you know just keep taking it day by day. You guys always play it cool on streaks, and we're not thinking too much about it. When does a 12-game win streak be something that you start to think about? Uh, you know I'm not too sure. I haven't been on too many 12-game streaks in the NHL, but. Uh, you know, I think as a group, you know, it's cliche. You, you just take it day by day, and, you know, we're a confident group right now, and, you know, we need to continue that.